Hey, what's up guys? It's Unique Riggers and it's episode 1 of Rush Hour, so this is a series where it's pretty similar to our uh, James Parra. And, well, the reason I've picked this series instead of doing, like, trading to a certain player or trading to a certain amount of coins is because them series at the minute, they seem to be, well, there's a lot of people doing them. And I wanted to do something which unique, but unfortunately this isn't a unique idea. But it's one of the series that not a lot of people do at the minute, so that's why I'm going to be doing this series. So hopefully you guys enjoy it. I'm going to go spend my 100k right now, so I'll be back in a second. So I've gone and spent my 100k, well most of my 100k, I've got 1,300 coins left and I'm going to show you how much I paid for my players. So the first player I got was Torres for 16k, I reckon I can sell him for about 20k because his formation but he'll probably go for about 18k but I'm hoping for a nice little profit on him. For Davies, for some reason there's actually a problem with him, it won't tell me how much I paid for him. Even when I press the right stick on him it doesn't say as well, but I think I paid 22k for him. For Olmo I paid 8,200, for Gerald I paid 15k. And then for Zaha, I paid 4,400. Pogba, I paid 8,500. I'm not sure if I'm going to make a profit on him. The reason I paid that amount was because he was the cheapest on the market in centre mid. The next cheapest one's 12k, but he is in a bad formation. So that may affect how much he sells for. And the final player, I'm not sure how to pronounce his name, Federici or something like that. 22,750 coins. And I'm hoping to make about 6k profit on him. So from this slot, I'm hoping to end up with about 130k coins. If I end up with, well, more than 100k, I'll be happy, because I'm just hoping to make a profit of these players. So I'm going to go put them all on the market now, and then I'll be right back. So, Davis's price has finally decided to show, and also in the last bit of the live commentary, I realised I said his name wrong when I was going through it, so I do apologise for that, but I paid 20,250 coins for him, so hopefully I can make a profit on him, and also a few of the other players' prices have changed, like the amount I paid for him for some reason, so there's an EA glitch there, but I'm not really sure how much I paid for each of the players, but if I end up with more than 100k, I've made a profit, so let's hope I can end up with more than 100k. So, just going to show you all the start price and the buy now price for the player. So, Torres is 17k start, 20k buy now. Davis, he's 23k start, 27k buy now. Gerard's 19,500 um, start price and 20,500 buy now. Federici, he's 24k start. He's just got a bid on him, so that's a great start. There's one profit right there. And also 28k buy now. So, that has 5,000 start, 5,500 buy now. Uh, Olmo, I think that's how you pronounce it, 11k start, 13k buy now. And Pogba's 9,400 and 11,000 buy now. So I'm hoping all the players can sell. At the minute, there's only a bid on Federici. So I'm happy with that. That's one player going for a profit. But I really need all of them to go for a profit if I'm going to make over 100k. So, well, actually, no. All of them actually need to sell, I think, for me to make over 100k. If Sahar doesn't sell, I may still be able to make over 100k. But for everyone else, they definitely have to sell if I want to make a profit. So going to go on to the next bit now, so I'll be right back. So, three of my players have sold. Torres has gone for 20k, Zaha has gone for 5,500, and Pogba's gone for 11k. For the remaining players, hopefully they can sell soon, because at the minute, well, 30 minutes left. I was hoping for them all to go for buy now, within the first 30 minutes, because I was trying to make them the cheapest on the market. But with these four, I'm happy that I've got a bid on Federici, but the other players, they definitely need bids on them or to sell. So, let's get rid of these players now. Oh, almost just sold there for 13k. So another player sold, so three more players, well Federici's got the bid on him, so really it's just Davis and Gerard that I need a bid on or for them to sell, so I'll be back soon. So Davis has sold for his 27k by now price, Gerard though unfortunately he still doesn't have a bid on him, and Federici still has his 24k bid on him, so at the minute it doesn't look like I'm going to make a profit. For Gerard there's two on the market, they're cheaper than him in 4-1-2-1-2, so hopefully they can sell so someone bids on my Gerard, but it's looking very unlikely at the minute, so I'll be back in a second to show you if they sell or not. So, Gerard managed to sell for 19,500, so I'm happy of that. Someone bid on him when he had about 5 seconds left. And for Federici, he sold for 24,250. So, I did make a profit for this episode, but at one point it looks like I wasn't, because Gerard, I didn't think he was going to sell, but luckily someone bid on him. So, I made a 15k profit for this episode, so I'm happy of that. So, if you guys enjoy this video, please leave a like. And also, if you want to see another episode of this, please leave a comment and let me know, because this is basically a trial episode. So, see you guys, you need riggers, and hopefully you enjoyed this video.